Hotshot crews have been fighting this fire on Moon Mountain all week, and many of them are fighting for their home. You try to let your emotions not take the, uh, be the best of you, you know, stay focused on the task. J.J. Rue knows Moon Mountain all too well. He grew up in Rio Doso, but for the last 15 years, he's been a hotshot, battling fires across the U.S. Yet when this blaze hit Rue's hometown, things all of a sudden got very personal for him. You don't want to see that, and you don't want to see it in anybody's, you know, community. 75% of our crew is from Rio Doso, and we would feel like, hey, we need to get home. Rue was here the night the fire was the hottest, working tirelessly to keep it from spreading to the town's high school, where he graduated. We actually went to... Uh, As we talked, uh, Rue pointed out we were sitting in the forest where he and his friends used to hang out, which is now a charred mess. We used to come up these hills and stuff like that, and, you know, it is really personal. I mean, it, it is. I just needed a... With the fire dying down, many are grateful fire crews got this thing under control. But Rue says... He needs no thanks. I'm doing it because that's my job and that's what I'm trained to do, you know. He's just doing his duty. Matt Howerton, KOAT, Action 7 News.